Welcome back to Studio STL. Well, there's a, a new music bar and private event venue that may be your next spot to hold a party. This next segment has been sponsored by The Attic Music Bar, where music is very much so on the menu. Joining us now are Justin Foff, the general manager, alongside of Nick Branson, bar manager. Gentlemen, thanks so much for being here with us today. Thanks for having us. Of course. I'm excited. I mean, tell us a little bit more about The Attic. Okay. Um, we're a live music private event venue. We're open Thursday, Friday, Saturday nights, 5 to 1.30, Sundays 11 to 5. Um, every Thursday we have our karaoke night where we have our house band plays 6 to 8 and then karaoke with Shaggy Sounds from 8.30 to 12.30. Every Friday and Saturday we have great live music. And then Sundays we're open for football and we have bottomless mimosas and bottomless mules. You had me and in And bottomless a... Bloody Marys. Oh, yes. and you Mary. can karaoke, switch them too. Yeah. Yeah. bottomless switch them mimosas, bottomless Bloody Marys. I mean, how did the Attic Music Bar get its start? So a good friend of mine came to me about, approached me about wanting to open a music venue and he, myself, and his father Rod decided to open it up, a place where we could do events and focus on the live music and Rod's a lifelong musician. I think that was some of Mike's inspiration for wanting to do it. We have a place where he could see his dad play music again. Nice. And, uh, yeah, we're located on the second floor of the building. We have a great restaurant on the first floor, Hoot At Southern Food Bar and Grill, and they were in here a few weeks ago on a Be Our Guest they segment. Were. <laughs> uh huh. And we work real closely together. So if you come up to the attic and you're hungry, you can order food from Hoodette and they'll bring it on up to you. It's the best of both worlds. Exactly. The best of both. And you guys, do you all do all kinds of music? We do. We, we have a large variety. We mostly have local St. Louis bands, which we have great St. Louis bands. But then we do also occasionally bring in a cool, unique touring artist as well. Mm, well, hey, it's a great way that you can come out, enjoy some music, maybe host a private event at the Attic Music Bar. And guess what? The drinks are also top tier. Nick, you're going to walk us through three yep. popular ones. Mm -hmm. What's the most, I guess, what's the best seller? At the uh, right now is the... Trixie Riot sold a lot over this last weekend. I'll make that one here in a second, but I was going to have you try this one first. Ooh. This is called the Gatsby. Okay, is it's this is this a mocktail or is this the real thing? It's a real thing. So I don't will go too smell crazy it, on so it. you know, I don't uh, lose my job today. <laughs> Ooh, that smells good though. Yeah. So What's it's in a, this? It's so it's a play on a Manhattan. It's a uh, normally Manhattan uh, goes with a uh, sweet vermouth. Instead, we use amaretto with it, and then our house made bitters that I made myself personally. And then a little bit of simple syrup and whiskey. Give it a stir, uh, strain it, serve neat with a seared orange that you give a little zest to. And yeah, that one's a huge seller. We, I we can used see to, why. I, yeah. I'm just smelling all the flavors. Yeah. It smells so good. So the next one I'm going to make for you guys is called the La Burra. Mm -hmm. What's in so this one? This is a play on a spicy tequila mule. Ooh. So we're going to line the glass with some tahini seasoning. We're going to throw that lime in there too to get the seasoning. Anything with tequila is a win in is, my book. I don't know if I win. This one's really good. I'm going to sneak past you here just a second so I can grab some ice for the glass. Go for it. Okay, uh, so, and that tahini seasoning is probably really, really this good. This is easily one of our more popular ones. Uh, so we're going to throw a little bit of mezcal in here first. Mm. Start off with that. This is a glass, this is a drink you make in the glass. You don't have to stir, shake, or anything like that. Throw some mezcal in there. Nice and easy as a bartender. Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> well, yeah, the hardest part is the whole whining with the tahini. Then we're going to throw some tequila in there. Okay. You always kind of want to do a circle as you're making, whenever you're making something in the glass, you want to give it like a little circle around Shh. all that. You need to come back and give me some bartending classes. I mean, yeah, all right, we can make, we can work on some. Next, That's we're going to do some nice. lime juice. Okay. We're going to do some simple syrup. Nice. And then since this is a mule, we're going to top it with a ginger beer. Yum. You can't go wrong with ginger beer. Some ginger people beer. love it. Some people hate it. Some, it's a yeah, win in my book. It, it's, uh, I, I love it. Like, a, like you can do something real simple, just like whiskey, ginger beer with some, you know, just like some vermouth in there, and you got a fantastic drink. So, yes, this is the La Burra. I'm smell this La Burra. Yeah. Let's see. I mean, we can Ooh. turn the camera away for a second if you I want know. to take a swig. Don't. <laughs> I won't do that, but hey. Turn, turns back around, the glass is just empty. <laughs> Look, the evidence all on my face. Well, guys, this is awesome. If people are at home and they're watching and they're interested in coming out, hanging out with you guys at the Attic Music Bar, where can they go to find you? Uh, go all to right. theatticmusicbar.com. All the information's there, our full calendar of all the bands when they're playing. Uh, Wanted to mention a couple quick events. Don't forget about New Year's Eve. We've got a big party planned. Mm -hmm. And Mardi Gras Saturday on the 18th of February. We're opening early at 1.30 and got live music going all day.
Now, just go ahead and mark your calendars. New Year's Eve, Mardi Gras, and any weekend, you can stop on in, enjoy some great music, head downstairs to Who Dat, get you some good food, great music, and delectable drinks. We'll make sure you have access to all of their information on our website at studiostl.tv. And you can also show them some love on all of their social media handles. Again, we'll make sure you have access to that information on our website. Again, studiostl.tv. Don't go anywhere, St. Louis. We'll be right back after this quick break.